Deputy President David Mabuza has cited tense contestation and the desire to keep unity in the party as his reasons for declining a nomination at the 55th a ANC uh, elective conference. He was nominated from the floor to stand for re-election. Mabuza also reflected on his tenure as a deputy president of the country. SABC News reporter Tumelo Machoho and video journalist Mzo Kotwana spoke exclusively to the deputy president at his farm in Barberton in Bumalanga. Unwinding at home after the highly charged ANC conference, Deputy President David Mabuza says he chose unity instead of contesting for re-election. He declined a nomination from the floor after he failed to get enough branch nominations. And probably to minimize contestation and to allow a bit of cohesion in the ANC. We don't just contest for our personal feelings. We contest because we want to add value to the organization. Sitting here, I'm, I'm okay with the leadership that has emerged. If well supported, this leadership can take us forward. Now, the, big, the biggest challenge that we face uh, is to try and minimize the internal challenges in the ANC so that we rebuild the ANC, we renew the ANC. Mabuza, the leader of government business, commented on the current energy crisis. He thinks the government has failed the in-battle power utility ESCOM and that its challenges are still going to be with us for some time. So, yes, the problem is going to be there for some time up until we invest in new generation capacity. Uh, there's no other way. So really, uh, as the ANC-led government, there we must accept because it cannot be the challenge of this administration. It's a challenge of success successive administrations that have failed to prioritize our energy generation. And now it's catching up with us. Many people have criticized Mabuza as an absent deputy president. But Mabuza says he's pleased with his achievements. The best part was my participation in the South Sudan uh, uh, intervention, trying to help the country to move forward to its uh, first democratic election. I'm very grateful about that milestone. Well, I've worked <clears throat> on the issues of uh, land reform. We've made quite good progress together with uh, Minister Titiza. The best achievement, which I think still needs to be pursued to its finality, is the communal land matter. Uh, to deal with the tenure arrangement, the tenure system of all our traditional communities so that they can utilize their land to their benefit. That, I think, was a major stride on the side of government. Mabuza hopes to continue saving his country in whatever way possible. Dumana Machoho, SABC News, Barberton.